right, so this is my uh, quad order biplane VTOL platform. It's about a 23 inch wingspan. I'm running 1000 kV Supa motors. I got them pretty cheap, uh, eight by four prop. And I got full uh, four by four Elevon set up here with the servos. Um, the way I got that set up on my radio is um, normally I'm flying basically rate mode with a quad. Um, and then I can go ahead and uh, flip a switch down here and that engages the Elevons. So I have full uh, roll and pitch. Um, and that's in conjunction with the rotor control and forward flight. So um, basically I have the addition of the control surfaces and the torque control on the motors. Um, and another note is when I switch between this forward flight mode and hover, I basically switch the action of the rudder and aileron sticks. So uh, rather than just flying like a quad in forward flight, I'm also getting uh, quite a bit of the uh, airplane experience uh, as it should be for VTOL platforms. Um, under the hood here, uh, I just got a 3D printed aerodynamic housing here. Um, it's a little heavier than I wanted to, all the weight uh, I'll, I'll post somewhere, but it's, it's a little more than I expected, but that's fine. Um, I got my flight control board here, which is the Teen Z 4.0. Uh, MPU 6050 uh, IMU down there. Uh, I got some 12 amp ESCs buried in there as well and a 2200 milliamp hour three cell. So um, let's go take it for a flight and see how, see how it goes. All right, here we go. A little bit of wind. All right, All right we got an hover here. There's just standard quad mode. Uh, stabilizing on rate set point. Let me bring it in closer. Um, that, that really awful whining, I don't know if you can hear it, not just the motors, but it's sort of like a, a horn. I think that's the derivative term in the controller that's acting up. I need to tune that down a little bit. Um, so let me this into half forward flight really quick. I'm not going to do a full transition. Nice. Okay. Bring it back. Okay. So now I'm going to do the same thing except halfway through that transition I'm going to flip the switch that basically turns it into an airplane. Flips the aileron and rudder control. And we're going to see how that goes. Okay, it feels just like an airplane. Side slip is a little bad. Okay, I just flipped it back into quad mode. I don't know if you can see, but I, just so I can get my bearings here. I'm gonna bring it down.